My name is uh, Stephen Easley, and I'm the representative for House District 50. House District 50 is an interesting geographically large district that starts just south of Santa Fe in El Dorado, which is where I live, runs through Santa Fe County, picks up the western half of Torrance County, and then swings underneath uh, uh, Bernalillo County into Valencia County, where we go almost over to Belén and Los Lunas. Uh, so it's a geographically large county, shaped like a very narrow, long green chili is the best way to visualize that, with the point being in Valencia County and the cap being in El Dorado. Well, I'm very pleased with my committee assignments. I've assigned to uh, the Energy and Natural Resources Committee, and I've been assigned to the Tax and Revenue Committee, and both of those are interesting and challenging committees because of the nature of the work and I really enjoyed being on them and I enjoy all of the people on the committees as well uh, both the Republicans and the Democrats there seem to be very good people who are interested in fair and honest debate on the bills and I couldn't ask for more you know it's been very hectic it's a lot of fun uh, coming new to the legislature even though I'm not totally new uh, has been uh, a steep learning curve there's a lot to know and I always say it's like trying to get a drink of water from a fire hose. There's just a more information coming at you than you can take right off the top. I was fortunate enough to have worked in state government for seven years as an IT executive. So I was here during those seven years for each and every day of the legislature. So I get to know a lot about the legislature and how it works and how it operates. Still, it's being different being on the inside. And as someone once said to me that it's, uh, it's fun to sit around the campfire, but it's a lot different to sit in the campfire. And I think that applies that little metaphor to the legislature as well. So I've really enjoyed it, but it's, it's a lot to learn. One of those top priorities is, of course, education. Um, <clears throat> we need to improve our educational system in our state, and we need to work on that now. Now is a critical time to do that. So that's number one. Number two is clean air, clean land, and clean water. We have to be very careful in New Mexico uh, what we do to maintain the heritage. We have a long heritage of clean air, clean land, and clean water, and we need to make sure that we leave that to our grandchildren and our great-grandchildren. So I'm very interested in those issues uh, and making sure that we do the right thing. Yes, I would like to know them to know that uh, we are working hard up here, that I believe the, the legislature is actually working well this year, perhaps better than in previous years, but in, I've been pleasantly surprised that everybody has been nice to each other, everybody has been collegial and helpful, and that we have uh, often more agreement than we have disagreement, and I think that's a good thing.